Hey everybody, Dr. Clark. I need to ask you a question. Do you have one of these? Now, not a three ring binder, but do you have one of these full of all the doctors that you've been to full of, you know, hair analysis results and food allergy results and Lyme test results and uh, meridian results and blood chem results? If you have one of these things, uh, you're probably autoimmune. You probably have an autoimmune condition, you know. Do you have like a shopping bag at home or a, a closet or a pantry that's full of supplements and herbs that you tried to take but they didn't work or that you reacted to them or you're allergic? Well, then you're probably uh, autoimmune. And that's bad news for you, to be honest, because there's very few people that are going to have any idea what to do with you. Um, first of all, none of them had an idea what to do with you because they didn't diagnose you correctly to begin with. And uh, today, I, the reason I bring this up today, I, I saw uh, a woman who... Uh, sent me one of these as part of her uh, pre-intake uh, process. And I tell you, anytime I see one of these, they're an autoimmune patient. Uh, you can pretty much just take it to the bank. And if you have one of these, you know, and you've been to 10, 12, 11 doctors, the, ch the chances are really high that you have an undiagnosed autoimmune condition. And what that means is your immune system has broken the ultimate taboo. It is attacking you. And when that taboo is broken, all heck can break loose. There is literally, literally, you can't name a condition right now, any condition that I can't find, I can't find in the research literature, not Dr. Clark, goofy alternative medicine literature, but the mainstream scientific literature that shows that that can be, result, to be the result of an autoimmune attack. I'm talking about infertility, miscarriages, uh, neuropathy, vertigo, I mean, MS, of course, we know are autoimmune conditions. But if you are undiagnosed, and this is speaking to those people that have chronic conditions, a chronic problem that no one's been able to you know, put a stamp on, but you've been to the Lyme's doctor, and you've been to the Mercury doctor, and you've been to the homeopathic doctor, and you've been to the, the craniosacral doctor, and you've been to the... When you've been to all those doctors and you still have the problem you have, I want you to remember, if you've got one of these full of all your test results, right, or you've got a, a shopping bag with, of supplements that you can't take because you're, quote, allergic, you should just take it to the bank that you have an undiagnosed autoimmune condition and you should pick up the phone or go to the web and you should contact my office because I'm one of the only people that's going to know what to do with you. Uh, I'm sure you've seen a lot of my stories and um, I can't impress upon you enough that this, if you've got one of these, uh, it's time to call.